Hey there, you guys. Today's wig is brought to you by Main Concept. Thank you so much, Main Concept, for sending me this wig. I'll be sure to leave the link below to this wig if I could find the link. I'm not sure if this wig came out yet. But in today's video, it's very special because I am doing a collab with the beautiful She Slay TV. Yes, look at her. If you are not subscribed to this beautiful woman channel, yes, sis, yes, give them that look, yes, then you need to check her out. One thing I love about her videos, she tells the truth about a wig. She will give you the 411, ladies. And she also gets like the wig in other colors. So instead of seeing it on the model, she's basically the beautiful model herself. So this is a fall collab. And I'm going to leave the link below to her video. So please check her out. If you do subscribe to her, please tell her that body by Kara sent you. The texture of this wig is a light yucky texture. This wig comes with Swiss lace. On the inside of the wig, you get two combs in the front by the temple. Another comb in the back with adjustable straps. And the way the parting comb is not bad, but I did go in and end up plucking it just a little bit. So I'm a little iffy about the wig on me. I love the color. The color is so beautiful. It's like a champagne kind of rose gold type thing going on. I really love the color scheme. I should have definitely brushed the back a little way better. So sorry about that. I didn't know until now editing it. I did see my sis Diona. I didn't see her video yet. And I'll be sure to check that out. So I think you should check it out too. But I definitely saw a picture of her in this wig. And oh my god. This wig looks so beautiful on her. But I must say the cut is a little choppy. I can go in with some clippers. And make the cut a little bit more neater. But then I don't want the bob to be too short. I do wish this bob was just a little longer. Because the color is amazing. They did a great job with the coloring. And I do wish in the back the brownie part was a little longer instead of the pink undercut showing a little more. I don't like that. You can see the pink undercut. Especially if I bend my head down. I don't want no way to see all that pinkness. But it's still cute. There was no tangling. Shedding was very minimum. The density of this wig is on the thin side. It's not too thick but it is not too thin at the same time this wig is big head friendly and i tried to do my signature style with the one piece of hair sideburn sticking out and you know the other piece behind my ear but it just wasn't working for me with this wig i think this wig is very cute but i just don't like it on me i really don't but it is a very pretty wig I even tried to turn it to the right and it just still wasn't working for me. To me, it is a no -y, no, no, no. But hey, I was trying, okay? I was trying. Maybe somebody was thinking, hey, how does it look on the right side part too? So because it looks so bad on the right side part, I definitely wasn't going to try it on the left. But I tried, people. But it's really not a bad wig. It's just not my kind of wig, you know? But I love the color. As always, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Later, you guys.